everybody, John here with Cheerful Ghost doing a let's play of Moria, or Moira. Moira's a new game on Kickstarter that I thought was really interesting and I decided to do a let's play of it. Um, it's on Kickstarter right now, you can play the demo, this is kind of the demo version, I've never played it before, I wanted to check it out, I really like the aesthetic of it, uh, I really like the visuals, let's check it out. Um, I'm screwing around with it a little bit and you can kind of, it's in this black and white mode or you can change the, swap the palette around, so I really like the My First Adventure run, so let's start it up. Alright, start a new game. The Kingdom of Animus. 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 It is well known for its great wizards and many magic schools that exist from the. I can't read that. Zippelli, Animus' greatest wizard. It's also. Is also a teacher and something Zippelli has gone missing. Okay, so fast I can't read it. To make things worse, there have been reports of strange happenings all around the world, and monsters have been lurking about and roaming free across the Eight Kingdoms. Rubric, a young magic student, and something grows tired of waiting for news of his master with the wand that Zapelli gave him in hand. I'd probably make the text flash by a lot slower. Uh, not a lot slower, just a couple seconds more. This journey to find out what happened to blah 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 blah. Alright. We're getting into the game. Something happened. And we're sleeping. We are sleeping. Hmm, looks like I love this Game Boy feel. Rubik, are you up yet? You are late to school, young man. Okay, I can jump around. That's kind of cool. Feels... A little sluggish, but I think that's just how it is. It's very, uh, kind of feels like a little like Kirby, I guess. Ah, oh, it's cool. You can jump up here. Kind of getting a really Kirby slash Zelda vibe from this. Like, uh, Adventures of Link. Have you seen the time? You should be at school already. Hurry up to class, young man, and don't forget your one, as you always do. I, I have it in my hand right here. Like, it's in my hand. Right here, you you don't see it in front. Of, it's right here. It's it's right here. I'm like, yeah, I was I was waving it around. Okay. Any anyways. Rubik, your teacher is looking for you. Go to school at once. Rubik, so I can't go that way. Good morning, Rubik. Enjoy your adventures while you're still young. I mean, you're not... You're not really old, though. You're li like, we look like the same age. First, Mr. Zippelli. Now Nico is also missing. I need to study for my magic exams, but I'm so worried I can't think about anything else. Okay, is this school? No. Hi, Rubik. How have you been? Ashley sent me a magic letter these days. Ashley sent me a magic letter these days? I don't get what that means. Ashley sent me a magic letter these days. Oh, oh, okay. She said she's enjoying her training in Neve. I'd love to go visit her. But the bridge to Neve fell during that last storm. I hope they fix it soon. All right, keep going. It's probably not school. I really have to get to school. People are saying the right Zapelli was kidnapped, but I don't believe them. Oh, I can go up that. Man, the game's doing everything to make it so that I don't have to go to school. Nico skipping class, that smarty pants always researching stuff no one ever heard of. Huh. The discoveries of the great Zapelli are truly magnificent. He is an inspiration to us all. Will I be as famous as someday? I hope so. Where is school? Alright, maybe he's off this cliff here. Alright. Oh, this looks like school. Great mage school of Overanos. 
Let's go in. I really like the graphics in this game a lot. I think that they're pretty good. Good morning, Rubik. Have you seen Nico around? Our class is starting soon. Good morning, Rubik. Have you seen it's the same person? I thought my curly hair was so original until it quickly became really popular in this town. Now I can't wait to have my hair cut really short. All right, so this is uh, town's first tipster. Grown him young, grown him young. Oh man, attention sucks. I've been here for two hours cleaning the entire classroom. I can't wait to get home and play some magic games. <laughs> I hear ya. Oh, this looks like a teacher. Hi, Rubik, I was looking for you. It's kind of like a dopier version of me. Your friend Nico is missing. I need you to find him. You have the power to mimic people's and enemies' abilities. I need you to use your power. Press X to use your wand and mimic my magic. Okay. <laughs> well done. Now you have my favorite magic beam. Now pay attention. You can release the power you're using pressing B. And you can use beam again by selecting it on the menu pressing start or using L and R. Rubik, use your powers to find Nico and bring him back. Talk to the town guards, they will help you. Alright, how do I hold it down? Oh, that's just, oh, that's just holding it down. Beam? Okay, I haven't found anything new yet. Just beam so far. This takes up a lot more magic than my other attack did. It's probably more powerful as well. I'm thinking about just playing kind of the beginning of this game. Hopefully we're getting some action soon. Oh, I don't really know where I'm supposed to go. Where are the waypoints? Let's go to the right. Always to the right. Teacher Presto said you would come. Use B to release your power and X to mimic me, Rubric. And please be careful, Nico was last seen going east towards the castle. B to release your power and X to mimic me. Okay. B. Okay. of confusion. It's too bad. I don't really understand the castle. Oh, I see. Sword, beam, sword. Okay, I'll use sword. Yeah! Oh, got him. Nice. Alright, so the sword doesn't take up. Oh, sweet. Castlevania style. You get items, or you get stuff by hitting the lamps. That's really cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, so far I'm getting my ass kicked, but I can get lots of parts, so that's nice. I'm going to switch. Mini. Got him. Let's head back to the sword. It's a very... It's got a very sort of like Castlevania Mega Man vibe here. The old Metroidvania. Okay, I can do that. Okay. Alright, 
Oh, I got an extra heart. Sweet! I dig it. I dig it. I jumped so far. This is cool. Seems like with games like uh, this and Shovel Knight, the old uh, sort of retro games are Retro aesthetic is getting a lot more popular. Oh man, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right. Oh, and I died. All right, what happens? Oh, I, I guess I have lives in the upper left, so I lose one. And there we are. I was right. Haha, <laughs> you can do the shovel knight down thrust, that's great. Good to know. Yeah! I killed so many guys! Murder yo! Murder yo! It's like a uh, place where I can come back to probably if I die down in A. Thank you for the tip. Killed that knight that did not have a shovel. That was a sword knight. Totally different. I got the key. Some kind of a boss. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, mini boss, maybe. Just a harder guy. Oh. Thanks a lot, Rubik. I owe you one. I thought I would be locked in here forever. Me, I came here to look for a clue in these books about where the great Zapelli might be. But then, the armors came to life and ended up locked in here. But hey, I found an old book written by the great Zapelli himself. It's about spell combination and ancient times where there were mages who combined spells to create new ones. And take a look at this door behind us. It has a symbol of a sword etched on it. Maybe if you can open this door with your power, Rubik, what if you combined your powers? Try accessing the menu and combining your sword and mean powers in this order. Alright. Sword. Sword. Go down. Bang. Alright. Cool. I dig it. It works. No, I have to talk to you first. This door behind us has a symbol of a strange sword. Maybe you can open it. If you combine your sword and chill, then please tell my parents and everyone else. Okay. Got it. Oh, it's sweet. It's like throwing swords. I don't think I'm going to play too much longer. Um, this has been really fun. All right, magic sword, sword, beam. I'll play Mr. Sword. Wow, this is really Mega Man themey. Okay. How do I get up here? How do I progress? Oh, I gotta mimic it, I bet. Mouse. Acquired the mouse. So, mouse, K. Okay. Oh, there we are. 
cool. I mimic you, mouse. When I think mouse and like mouse mechanics, I think a scapegoat, so this is really kind of cool. Uh, I really, really liked those scapegoat games. Alright, mouse. Let's go to Mr. Sword. Awesome. Wow. We came out all the way on the other side of the map. Cool, I wonder if we can continue on with that. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna... go the other direction, and then I think I'll be done with this level. But this is a fun game, I dig. Oh. Oh man, so Mega Man-like. Enemy identified. Keep rolling. there. Unless I mimic this platform or something. Alright. Oh. Oh. Should I mimic you, Mouse? Probably should, right? Oh, yeah. To get out, of course. Stop mimicking, mimicking the mouse later, though. This soundtrack's a toe tap, our kids. I really like it. All right, let's go back to Mr. Sword. It's the right way. I have no idea. I have no idea where I'm going. I like there are like a zillion power-ups. There you go. It's really nice. Okay. Oh. Hello, robot man. I can mimic this guy. Can I climb that? Oh, I'm getting hurt. Mr. Sword will teach you. Oh man, almost dead. What? No! Ah, oh, show toast. That's pretty cool. Awesome. All right, everyone. I'm going to... All right, everyone. Thanks for watching me uh, play this uh, extremely short uh, Let's Play for Amoria or Moira. Um, check it out on Kickstarter. It's been successfully funded, but they still have a little bit to go. And if you want to get in on the new game or fund them forward, I should check them out. All right. Thanks, everyone.